hi guys welcome to another interesting video so in this video i'm going to be showing you how to remove deceptive sites ahead on your website so let's get into business so first of all you have to um, have a google account and then next you go to your browser and then type google console Okay, what we are about to do now is to send a request um, pleading that your site is not used for any negative things. Your site is legit and so on. So after making this request, your request will be looked into and then when it's approved, the um, the warning will be removed completely from your site. So I'll just go and then click on this link. And then I'll go ahead and then click on start now. Copy the link of my website that is showing deceptive and then paste the URL. Go ahead and then copy. Then I'll go ahead and then paste it here. And then click on continue. So I'm going to, um, I'll, I'm asked to verify my um, website. So what I'm going to do is to download this file and then upload it on my cPanel. So I'll just locate public underscore HTML on my cPanel and upload the file I just downloaded. So right now I'm logged into my cPanel. I'll go ahead and then click on File Manager. visit this website on save i'm going to click public underscore html so finally i'm going to upload So I'm done uploading the file, I'll go ahead and then click on verify. So ownership verified, I'll go ahead and then click on go to properties. So if you look at the right corner, under full reports, click on it, it has detected an issues already, click on it. And then I'm going to click on request review. So I'll click on all issues we have fixed. And then I'm going to write a short note. Okay. Um, you can follow this pattern whenever you're making a request that um, your site um, has been flagged deceptive and the deceptive warning should be removed. Please make sure you do not post any link. Uh, you should not include link whenever you are writing, you are composing this. Do not include links. So when you are done, you click on submit requests. So request submitted successfully. So I'm signed in with a Google account. So I'm going to wait for the next 24 hours or 48 hours to get a reply from them to um, see if my request have been approved or not. So if, your, if my request is being approved, the 
flag warning is going to be removed completely so make sure you keep on checking your mail if you know this video is helpful make sure you hit the subscribe button like and then share this video thank you see you in my next video